Welcome to HXGN TV. I'm your host, Bill Fetter. Today we're talking about QDAS statistical process control software with Edgar Dietrich, president of QDAS. Morning. Good morning. Welcome. So let's start with what's the focus of QDAS? Yeah, QDAS is at first a software company. Uh, with our software in the manufacturing area, we collect data from the different measurement processes and uh, we manage this quality information. Uh, then uh, we have uh, different kind of statistical methods to make the evaluations and present the results uh, to the uh, users, operators and uh, all uh, different kind of stuffs in, in the um, uh, production. And um, uh, in the meantime, we have more than 8,000 uh, companies worldwide using our software and about uh, 200,000 uh, users in the different industry sectors. Okay. Um, can you tell us a little bit about the focus of the product line? What, uh, how, what kind of different products do you have available? Yeah, I would like to explain it in a form. Uh, if you uh, produce a part, okay. it's independent which kind of uh, part you produce. Okay. Uh, uh, you get the requirements from the design department or from the customer. Uh, they describe this in a CAD drawing uh, with a different kind of um, uh, characteristics. All the characteristics are specified in with tolerances and all the other things and uh, then the question is at first do you have a measurement process which is capable to measure uh, okay. the, and uh, and find out if the measurement process can use to measure the different characteristics okay. for that we have a product is called Solara MP okay. Step number two, uh, you must uh, take care that um, the machine, the, the processes are capable to produce a different kind of characteristics. Okay. And uh, for that, um, you had to do machine uh, or preliminary or process capability studies. Okay. For that, we use uh, the product uh, QStat. Okay. And if you are satisfied with uh, all your equipment, uh, then you, you then start, you can start measuring, right? <laughs> start measuring, yeah, yeah. and uh, use then the typical SPC methods uh, like quality control charts uh, to um, uh, monitor uh, the status of the uh, different um, characteristics and uh, show if it's always uh, no big change or it's no uh, significant change in the process so you could be sure that everything uh, goes in the right way. Okay. Next step is if you are not satisfied with the situation you mm -hmm. have to improve the process you right. have to optimize it and for that we use uh, methods like design of experience variance analysis, regression analysis, or different kind of test procedures. And for this, we have the product Destra. Okay, uh, that's quite com complete product line, sounds like. Yeah. yeah all, all end to end went from the, from the design process through manufacturing. Um, how about uh, where, where is the product used? Where you, you, you mentioned a few different departments that might be using the product. Who, who, uses, the, who, who uses this in the, in the end? Yeah, let's explain this for example in a, on an engine uh, plant. Okay. Uh, I guess this is, uh, you can case. transfer it also to other production. Okay. Uh, in an engine plant uh, you have uh, for example uh, thousands of characteristics uh, to measure and that means you have a lot of different um, measurement uh, stations. So we can collect the data from the different stations uh, and uh, transfer the data through the network to a central database and uh, then start the evaluation and the monitoring on the shop floor and also for the for the management mm -hmm. and uh, for that we specially developed our QDAS camera concept uh, okay. that it's uh, all the products is easy to install and uh, we can train the people and uh, can show uh, the uh, results in a very quick form. Okay so you mentioned this this camera I, I'm, I'm assuming you're not talking about a camera <laughs> like like we've got right here where it's, it's this acronym right? Yeah. yeah but the idea is nearly behind the same because okay. we would like to give a picture of the processes okay. of what's right. going on. This okay. is, that's the reason why we use camera, but uh, the sense of the different uh, cap uh, characteristics are uh, the C stands for collecting, okay. A for assessing for the on the shop floor level, right. uh, then the E for the evaluation. Okay. Uh, sorry, I forgot the A before. This was uh, the um, for the M. I forgot the M. Okay. This for for data management. Okay. Uh, right. The E is for evaluation, and R is for reporting, and finally, if you 
get millions of uh, data and terabytes of data, right. uh, you had to archive the data sure. and bring it outside of the central database. Okay. And that is the meaning of uh, of the camera concept. Okay, and that's that's that concept is incorporated into the whole product line. Then that's that's how the process works. Yeah, this is uh, yeah the the idea that all the products play together easily. Mm -hmm. We have our standard data format. It's okay. uh, well known in the automotive industry. Uh, we call this data format AQDEF. AQDEF mm -hmm. stands for Advanced Quality Data Exchange uh, Format. Okay. And um, more than um, uh, 100 uh, companies support this data format. Okay. So uh, that means if you um, go to a new customer, um, we can install our, our uh, software, read the data from the different gauges and uh, show the results. So it's an interoperability yeah. concept uh, yeah. for the data exchange. That's true. Yeah. Okay. And that and that exchange supports transfer of that information <coughs> over the over the internet and through the through from yeah, database we, to database? We can uh, handle this uh, uh, through the, not, not only through the internet, uh, but mostly the company you have uh, their private network. Private network sure. <laughs> uh, a good example is a company Bosch. Uh, they use it in uh, uh, 150 plans at the okay. moment. Uh, they use two serv servers, uh, one is in Singapore, the other one in, in Germany, and all the data goes through the network uh, to these uh, two uh, servers uh, and, uh, and makes a re evaluation, sends the results back and then that's it's easy to uh, to handle because right. you have only two installations yeah. right but but this I imagine would work would this work in a supplier uh, a supplier relationship as well I mean the, the AQ def format could be used yeah. by the supplier and then transferred yeah. upstream to the next uh, the, to the next vendor the, this is uh, what especially the the OEMs uh, like to see <laughs> yeah uh, that means uh, that they have also access to um, uh, their the processes of the first or second tier suppliers um, mostly they the, the suppliers don't ac accept the direct link but uh, they are be able to send the data uh, out to the OEM then they can see the results and can accept except if uh, the, the, the products are um, in, in a good status and can be delivered. Excellent, all right. Well, um, as, uh, as I don't think we mentioned yet, uh, QDOS is part of the Hexagon Manufacturing Intelligence That's family true. now for uh, uh, about a year. Yeah. And um, um, how, how are things going with that? I think it goes very well, and uh, personally, I'm very satisfied with the situation uh, because uh, now we are also responsible for the MMS. MMS stands for okay. uh, Manufacturing Management Suite. This is yes. a, a platform um, where we integrate all the QDAS products, uh, the camera concept, and uh, in addition, the MMS Pulse and the MMS uh, Cadence. Mm -hmm. And I think the responsibility which QDAS has now in, in Germany is uh, is, is tremendous, yeah. yes. but we like the situation because uh, for the in the thinking organization, I guess mm -hmm. we play a very very important part. Yes, yeah. very good. All right. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate your time today. Yeah. Welcome. And thank you, uh, that's Dr. Edward Dietrich, our uh, uh, president of QDAS Statistical Process Software. For more information on QDAS, visit hexagonmi.com, and for more from HXGN TV, visit hxgntv.com. Thanks for watching. Watching.